Disney brings millions of visitors to Florida each and every year, but the company's criticism of Florida's Parental Rights and Education Act, dubbed Don't Say Gay, have also led some to blast Disney on social media. But are those social media stories criticizing Disney true? News Channel 8 political reporter Evan Donovan joining us now with a closer look. Press took a close look at a few of the most common online allegations out there right now. You may have seen some pop up in your Facebook feed. Let's break it down for you and show you what they found. The first claim spreading around the internet is that Disney has close ties to child sex abuser Jeffrey Epstein. Posts claiming Disney was sending kids to Epstein's pedophile island for snorkeling trips are false, according to the AP. Disney said in a statement that the island, as well as another location, were included in the description of a third-party tour. The tour had no connection to the island itself, and Disney has never had plans involving the island. A second claim that Disney was planning to build a theme park on Epstein's island was refuted by a spokesperson for Epstein's estate. Morning, everyone. Another viral post claims more than 100 Disney employees were arrested for human trafficking, child abuse, and prostitution. Eight on your side viewers may remember the actual bust where Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd arrested 108 people, a total of four told deputies they were Disney employees. Another viral claim, this one on Twitter, that Disney CEO Bob Chapek was arrested for human trafficking in California. There is no record of that and no proof that it happened. The AP says the original tweet was removed by Twitter and that user was suspended. What Disney has done is denounced Florida's new parental rights bill, labeled Don't Say Gay by critics, after the bill passed, saying it should never have been signed into law and committing to repeal the law or get it struck down in the courts. Their stance drew sharp criticism from Governor Ron DeSantis. I think that crossed the line. This state is governed by the interests of the people of the state of Florida. It is not based on the demands of California corporate executives. They do not run this state. They do not control this state. The AP reached out to Disney for comment on these stories, but outside of where I mentioned specifically their response, they did not comment further. Evan Donovan, 8 on your side.